Hi friends, today we are going to discuss about how you can create a simple program that is going to send email. Okay, so I'm not going to create a simple program. It would be a program that every system will be having and you just need to copy paste and edit and change it accordingly based on your requirement. Okay, so the standard program that you are going to use is this. So I'm going to SE38, I'll start from here. And this is the function module that we generally use. So just use this as handy or you can create your own function module or something. This is something that you are going to use it all the time. So here you create SE38, you can create a function module, you can create a class or whatever you want. So I go to SE38 and I give this program name, okay? And here I'll execute. And here I'll put my e, put an email address. Okay, so I'll put uh, this code 13 at gmail.com and I'll just test it. And I'll say test email and content. I'll say, I'll just type in something. And here I will just put student, my ID here, it's showing already, good. And I'll just hit execute. The moment I hit execute, I need to see where it went. So there is a transaction I can use is SOST. So let me go to SOST. So I'll go to slash and SOST transaction. And here you can see just I sent test email. This is the one that I just sent. And you can see it's display and it has all this garbage thing that I populated. Okay, so if I click on display, and again, lots of times you send it with attachments, so that email, that that thing will also help you on that. So if you can see, you can click on the workflow inbox, and it will be close this from this trying to open a session, which it cannot. So if you click transferring package one of one, so so it's it saves this data, okay, and you can see the attachments. So you can click on the attachments, and here, oops, yeah, here it is. So you can see the maximum. Okay, it was trying to open. I couldn't because it was hitting so let me click on it now the attachments will open up okay so uh, so so here so it's pretty simple the so the table the program that we used is this is the program name okay and this is standard now it opened okay it's pretty slow here uh, and here the important thing is you just look at this program and build your logic based on it okay and uh, and you will be able to figure it out so the package the packing list is the one that is for the attachment the you know the recipient data the receiver is this and then you have the content and you have the header header is probably the, um, the subject the content is the body and that's it. If you put the debug, you will be able to figure it out. Okay. That's it. Stay tuned to my SAP channel and happy SAP learning and have a great day.